All right, so what's up everybody? Zaggy Customs. Just wanna go over what we got going on today, or what we hope to get done today. Uh, we got some of the Porsche here, sunroof. We're gonna be doing this, blocking this. Um, you can see we got some primer on here, and then we did some dry guide coat. And what that does when we block it, we can see all these little imperfections. Um, and we'll block it back and forth till it's, you know, basically perfect. And then we'll hit it with a, another coat of sealer or primer. Try and get that back in focus. There we go. Basically making sure that the surface is extremely smooth and perfect. Over here on the Datsun, it's what everyone's been following along. The past couple of videos have been about, as you saw before, it's basically where we left off. Hope to get this side finished and in primer definitely today. Uh, hope possibly weld up some more spots, but most likely just focus on this side. You see we got the carbon fiber hatch in, really nice. Uh, we brought that in so we can make sure that this spot up here was nice and level. We still got a little work to do on that, but not much. We'll also guide coat and block this, the roof, and around the windshield. Uh, on the inside, I haven't really talked too much about, but I did, uh, the customer, Doug, did drop it off. The uh, lizard skin sound deadening, we're gonna be spraying that all inside the floorboard and then painting over it. The door panels, the roll cage, um, will all be painted the exterior body color. So we'll be doing that. We're gonna leave the engine bay uh, alone, at least the front half of it, because we still gotta do some fabrication work. Um, the firewall there, I might do some too, but again, I wanna really focus on the passenger side over there. All right, so we got this all guide coated, blocked out. You can see we got a low spot right here, a couple high spots. Another low spot right there, and on the other side. All these little uh, marks and such from when we stripped the roof, those will come out with the high build primer. See another low spot right there. So we will go through, tap down some of the high spots, do a little bit of filler in the lows, and then do another high build primer, and then go back to blocking that again. Make sure it's super flat. We got our last little bit of filler on the side here. Get ready for primer. Looking nice. Started cleaning it up in the back hatch area. You see we got some bad rust here and all this stuff is all tweaked. You can see none of this is straight. We're gonna straighten all that out as well. Alright, so we got a lot of this ground out. Not too bad, we got a really bad spot here. We'll cut, replace. Up through here isn't too bad. Still gotta finish cleaning it up. See, pretty bad dent there and raised here, so we'll mess with that in a little bit. Down here, this is all body filler. Really, really thick. So, good work on grinding that all out, see what's underneath, see why they did that, because I have no idea. Yeah, keep moving along. Well, now we know why there was so much body filler. There seems to be some kind of patch panel here. Um, and then something going on here, because you see the metal's high, and right here, and then this whole channel, whatever's underneath, I don't know yet, but is all filled. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen there because we got metal showing here. So that means this goes in and this goes in. Uh, I got a dent here um, and God knows what else where I haven't ground out yet. Um, you can see a little, little hole there. Um, yeah, it's nice dent right there. Uh, really bad, this whole rear end is going to be terrible. Uh, I can't grind anymore today because we're about to paint and it filled the whole room with dust so I don't want to contaminate any more than I have to today but at least we know we're in for you know some good stuff here. 
Here's some more of the Porsche parts here. Really nice pearl white. A lot different than the pearl whites you see on uh, a lot of the vehicles today. It's much more of like an off-white eggshell color. Really, really nice in the sun. You get that heavy pearl flake in there. Really, really nice. Good stuff. Yeah. Yeah, they're really nice. These haven't been wet sanded or anything, so. Don't judge till it's finished, but really look good. Just want to give you guys a quick look at the Porsche wheels. These are, uh, just got sprayed not long ago. Still wet, so I don't want to get too close. You just sprayed the uh, same pearl white that the body of the car is. Look real, real nice. This will get wet sanded and polished, just like the car. But yeah, look really good. Moving along on the Porsche project. Also, over here we've got Sunroof, again, same pearl white, and some door handles. Nothing crazy, but progress. Should have the body of the car here in the booth in the next couple of days. All right, so we finally have some primer on the quarter. It's looking pretty good. Put the body line back. Still got a little work to do here and there, but we're gonna guide coat this and block it out. Make sure she's perfect. Again, down there, there was a lot of uh, things that have been changed or replaced, welded in. So, gonna make sure that's all good. Roof's looking really flat. That should come out perfect. Doors off. We still got this piece here to cut out and weld in. The whole inside, you can see, still needs to be prepped. We're working on that. We got filler up front, needs to be sanded down. Make it look nice, nice. Doug came by today, cut out the panels that used to be here. He needs that for the intercooler to fit. And yeah, make it progress. I'll see you guys on the next video. Cool idea for this channel. Um, it's going to be a segment besides the work segments that I've been posting lately. Um, not used to holding a camera in my face like this, but uh, I don't want to announce it yet, but just know that it's coming very soon. I'm actually going to be contacting uh, probably five to ten people uh, over the course of today, tomorrow, and the next day to start arranging this project. Uh, I think it's going to really... Um, be cool content, uh, something that's interesting to not just people watching me work on cars, but uh, you know, something that friends, family, everyone can kind of enjoy and, and you know, uh, just more overall uh, content, suitable content, I guess. Again, I just kind of do this on the whim, but yeah, we look forward to that and hopefully we can get it going this weekend and hopefully get that content out to you the following week uh again i want to tell everyone what it is but i don't want to tell anyone till i know we've got like everything squared away um because again i think this is going to be one of the coolest things um for not only this area but for this channel and uh for the car